there's no wind. All the ducks left the day before season started. Six, but they go. This one little place. This is the secret hole. You've never seen this film. This is what we call the secret hole. We've kept it secret for years. And now we're revealing it here today. So enjoy. Do you know what I got this? The crew we're running with. This 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 is your beard, Jay. See that? You gotta have it. Come up and yeah. hit this two by six. No, he fell right. He I fell seen right stars. Right yeah. Good he fell Shoot it right there. Shoot it right there. Hey, Phil. Yeah. This what you've been looking for? It's been primarily wood ducks and gadwalls. Farmers, all the farmers down there that we hunted on their land. We'd hear the pickup coming. Yeah, well, we'd take off running. Well, they'd just chase us in the pickup. You know, they was just doing it for fun. You know, we thought they, you know, going to get, we'd get in trouble. Nah. We found out as we left, got away from there. They said, man, we used to like chasing you, chasing you boys. He said, y'all like wild deer. He said, we'll see just a flicker every once in a while while you're running down through the woods. Well, hey. Phil, Phil, the basketball coach, you know, Phil, you know, told him, said, hey, he said, man, you need to come squirrel hunt with me. He said, I found them, you know, we'll kill 50 apiece. Yeah. So, 
Look, they're walking across the field. You know, and you know, I hate to do this. It ain't no problem about hunting there. If it's a no, it ain't no problem. You know, so they walk across the field. Phil hears that pickup, and all he does is turn around and says, "Run, coach!" <laughs> and he's already in the woods. I pulled up, they got, and said, "What are you doing over here?" He said, "I'm just coming over here to try to kill a few squirrels." You know, next day the coach said, "Man, why didn't you tell me we was on posted land?" He said, "Hey, I knew you wouldn't come if you did." <laughs> Yeah. Doing good. Yep. Woody fast. Look how that blind blends in over there. Look over there. We got them cypress trees. I planted them. I just, just made me a, a blocker and them cypress trees just go into the blind there and ducks can't see on their approach. That's north, that's south. Catch northeast winds, the best one coming like this. See, they can't see that blind over there. I can't help it if I did design it, it's pretty slick, real slick. The wood duck is one of the best eating ducks there are. Many ways to cook a wood duck, but in this case, I'm going to breast them out and we're going to make duck wraps with them. The easiest way to breast out a woody, now woodies can be a little more difficult than other ducks. Teal are really easy to peel, mallards are easy, gadwalls are easy. Wood ducks and your divers are pretty tough to peel. That, that fat, that skin will stick to the breast. So I try to stick my finger right down that breast line where that, uh, that uh, breast bone is. And then I'll start with my index fingers to get underneath the skin and just peel apart. Work my way down. Work my way down. I'm just peeling all the way down to the bottom. And then I'm going to thumb it I expose the breast just like that then take your knife cut right down the breast breastbone make another cut at the top there's your wood duck breast I would rank wood duck as number two on as far as table fare among ducks He's number two. Green wing teal is number one. If you got somebody who peel them for you, it goes twice as fast. Yeah. Sometimes. But you got to have a good wood duck peeler. That's it. Boy, he's tenderized. The heavy shot number four is, looks like tungsten. Number four tungsten. That's my mm. shoot. All right, hamburger, hamburger, perfect. All right, we're done. Now we just go take them in the house, put them in a big silver bowl, get all the feathers off of them, tenderize them, put them in a brine overnight, and then we'll either grill them or fry them, whatever you want to do with them. All right, I'm going to show you a good little recipe that I like to use, put these ducks on a grill that we shot. And it's got a quarter cup of olive oil, a quarter cup of lemon juice, I got some Worcestershire, I got a little bit of liquid smoke. It calls for five garlics, but I didn't have any, so I got this little squeeze kind. You squeeze it out. Pepper, a tablespoon of pepper. I like a little more. And a tablespoon of salt. So you mix that up in a bag, that's all you do. Put it in a zip, good Ziploc bag.
and you put your woodies in there. This is brass out of them woodies you just washed the seat. Oh yeah. I'm gonna put this on the grill. Uh oh. A little bit of back strap. A little bit of deer back strap. I'm gonna put that on there too. But you put it in a Ziploc bag. Make sure it's closed real good. Mix it all up. Just massage it in. Make sure everything's mixed up good. Do this the night before. Let this marinate all night. And until you get it in the grill. Which I'll tell you more about that tomorrow. Because with the magic of videoing, It'll be tomorrow before you know. All right, I'm gonna put this on. Now listen, you wanna do this on indirect heat. You don't wanna do it, if you got a charcoal grill, you don't wanna do it right over the charcoal. Build your fire to the side, and put these over on the other side. Indirect heat, golly, this is gonna be good. Whew. All right, I got it on 250. I may turn it up to uh, 275. I want it to get that smoke, and I'm gonna save this. I'm gonna pour a little bit on there in a minute, about 15 minutes. Let's see if I need to flip it. Oh yeah, oh yeah. They looking right now. Oh yeah. Let's see where we at. Bet you they ready. 149. I'm gonna give them about five minutes. Oh, oh, oh. oh wood duck. Fresh. Oh yeah. Look at there. Still a little pink in the inside. Warm pink though. Just right. Look, I'm squeezing it. No blood. Here you go, cameraman. I'm gonna make sure he don't act funny. Let me look at his face. Oh, that oh, smile yeah. tells it all. Oh, yeah. That smile tells it all. Hey, good recipe, quick. Marinate them all night. Throw them on the grill. Watch that temperature, about 145, 150. You feed this to your woman. You finna get shell money, waiter money, gas money. Go get me some more of that. Mm. Woo! Man, that's good. Thank y'all for watching. Leave some comments. And don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see y'all next time.